I'll bet that you've never really considered this, but right now your heat pump could be hosting some very unwanted furry little tenants. We recently removed the covers of our heat pump and found plenty of evidence that mice had been inside. So in this video, we're gonna talk about vermin and heat pumps, why they're such a bad mix, and what you can do to stop them from getting in. So whether you live in the middle of a city or out in the countryside like we do, it's worth going outside and having a look at your unit. Check for gaps, loose insulation or holes with a pipes and drainage exit. Mice only need a space the size of your thumb to squeeze through, and once they're in, they'll make themselves extremely comfortable. In our case, they'd found two perfect entry points, one around the drainage pipe, the other by chewing through the foamy insulation on the refrigerant line that leads into the unit itself. That then gave them direct routes to warmth and shelter via other access points inside the unit itself. Inside, we found one sensor cable completely bitten through and another half gnawed and the internal insulation torn to shreds. It looked like a tiny mouse hotel and that soft foamy insulation must have been nesting heaven for them, warm, dry, easy to shred, and close to multiple components and pipes that emit a lot of heat. And it's not just us, other users on the Renewable Heating Hub forums have also posted photos of damage done to their heat pumps by rodents. So here's what you can do. Check the insulation and gaps around all pipes and wires leading into the center of the unit. Seal any holes or entry points with tight wire mesh or steel wool, do not use foam or other soft, easy to shred materials. Keep the area around your heat pump clear of grass, leaves and debris. And if you see droppings or shredded material, act quickly. A regular five minute inspection every couple of months, especially during the heating season when it's warm inside the unit, could save you a serious headache and a lot of money. So if you've ever found signs of mice or damage inside your heat pump, please let us know in the comments and let us know how you sealed the access points and stop them from coming back. Your experience might just help someone else avoid the same problem. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.